Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. This is Geeta. Today we'll be solving your question from Chipmat 2021 question paper. A man rose 20 km upstream and back again to the starting point in 110 minutes. If the speed of the stream is 2 km per hour, then the speed of the rowing is still water. This is question mark. So from the first sentence, the data we have here is, so the man rows 20 km upstream. So the distance for upstream is 20 km and back again. So the starting point, so which is again downstream. So the distance downstream is also equals 20 km. The time taken, total time taken here is 110 minutes. So since this is in minutes, we will convert this into R, this km per hour. So which is 110 divided by 60. To convert minutes into hours, we have to divide by 60, which is equals 11 by 6 hours. If the speed of the stream is 2 kilometers per hour, so we know the speed of the stream, which is equals 2 kilometers per hour. So we can have the speed of the stream as V. And then the speed of the rowing in still water, that is the speed of the boat, which is U, equals question mark. But we can have it as X now. The formula we know here is speed equals distance by time. So since we know time is same in both these cases we can have it in, for, in terms of time so we can equate it so time equals distance by speed so which is equals for downstream it is distance is 20 divided by speed is for downstream the speed will be equals to plus v so which is the speed of the boat in still water plus speed of the current so which is u is x and v is plus 2 whereas for upstream it will be u minus v that is the speed of the boat in still water minus the speed of the stream or current which is x minus 2. So now substituting these values here. So for downstream it is u plus v which is x plus 2 and for upstream it is 20 divided by x minus 2. So from the question we know this the time taken for 110 minutes which is for both upstream plus downstream. So, which is 110 minutes, which is 11 by 6 hours equals upstream, which is 20 by x minus 2 plus downstream 20 by x plus 2. So, simplifying this, we can find the value of x, that is the speed of water and still water. So, 11 by 6 equals the LCM of this 2 is x minus 2 times x plus 2 and cross multiply 20 into x plus 2 which is plus 20 into x minus 2. Therefore 11 by 6 equals 20x plus 20 into 2 is 40 plus 20x minus 20 into 2 is 40 divided by x plus 2 into x minus 2 equals x square minus 4. Now I can cross multiplication 11 into this one and 6 into this one plus 40 and minus 40 gets cancelled so it is 20x plus 20x which is 40x so 11 into x square minus 4 equals 6 into 20x plus 20x which is 40x so which is equals 11x square minus 44 equals 240x so rearranging this equation which is 11x square 240x comes aside which is minus 240x minus 44 so finding factor for this one is not that easy so we can use the formula which is minus b plus or minus root of b square minus 4ac by 2a so where a is 11 b is minus 240 and c is minus 44 so substituting these values in the equation which is minus of minus b which is minus 240 plus or minus square root of b square so minus 240 whole square minus 4 into a is 11 and c is minus 44 divided by 2 into a is 11 so which is equals Simplifying this again, so 240 minus into minus becomes plus, plus or minus square root of 240 square, that is 24 square is 57600, zero, zero. minus into minus becomes plus, 4 into 11 into 44 is 1936, divided by 2 times 11 is 22, so again 240 plus or minus 57600 zero, zero, plus 1936 is 59536, divided by 22, so 240 plus or minus square root of 59536 is 244 divided by 22 so which is 240 plus 244 is 484 divided by 22 so which is this when simplifying this we get 11 times 2 is 22 11 times 4 to 4 is 484 2 22 times is 44 
so which is 22 kilometer per hour the other one is 240 minus 244 so which is 240 minus 244 divided by 22 equals minus 4 by 22 which is equals minus 2 by 11 so it cannot be negative so the answer is 22 kilometer per hour therefore the speed of the rowing in still water is 22 kilometer per hour thanks for watching if you have any doubts please let me know in the comments